A palimpsest is a page or a leaf from a document where the original text has been either washed away or scraped away in order to reuse that writing material for a new document. It's essentially parchment, which was quite often used as the writing material at the time, was quite an expensive um, commodity to come across and to make. So for any of these areas where there was um, a high demand for writing materials, parchment would be reused um, for any of these ancient texts. So they would take the parchment, um, clean off the original text and then reuse that to put writing on top of it again. If the area itself didn't have a high percentage of papyrus or paper available in the area and parchment was predominantly used as the writing material, then quite often it would be reused um, rather than using new materials which weren't available. Multispectral imaging helps us to read palimpsests by using a range of different lights in order to um, enhance any of the different chemical compositions in the manuscript itself. So differences between ink and parchment become quite apparent under different lighting conditions. The applications of multispectral imaging for the British Library include recovering erased and faded text, um, recovering information that has been lost due to um, damage over time, water damage, fire damage, anywhere where there's text that has become illegible over time. We found using multispectral imaging on this manuscript that there are three different texts within the original manuscript. Um, the parchment palimpsests that have been used are um, partial folios. Quite often they've been inserted to improve the strength of the original folios. In the future, I imagine we will be combining imaging techniques such as 3D imaging with something like multispectral imaging, which we currently use at the British Library. Combining these techniques which allow us to recover faded and lost information with information about the internal structure of objects would be critical.